my experiences with Captain B.E. and unfortunately Chaos have been very, very shitty. Um, you know, the night they pulled all their bullshit where they, um, you know, where B.E. had nuked the entire EC Discord was the same night that I had to go, that I had to take my GED test the following morning. Thankfully, I passed the GED test, but I wasn't too happy about having to remake the Discord server. And, um, you know, I, you know, personally, I thought Chaos was a good guy. He, me and him got along well. He was pretty chill to work with. Whoa. But, you know, finding out that he, you know, was an actu actually a traitor, you know, that, that was very shitty for me to find out. Whoa. And, um, and then the whole bullshit drama about Captain and Viper is just getting to the point where it's stupid and, you know, we have not messed with Captain, we have not done anything to Captain for a while, and you know, him just coming back And I even raiding the openly agreed with the rest of the TFEA to not do any raiding or anything towards him. I even, like, yeah. literally even stated to my TFG, to the founders and the administrators and everybody that I'm not going to raid their Discord. Even though there's many times that I want to and what to do in that situation, I'm usually the most calm person in this situation. Like, don't get me wrong, even Grim wanted me to fucking raid their Discord, and I'm like, bro, that's just gonna... Nah, bruh. That's just gonna be like, nah. That's just gonna cause more shit. Like, but yeah, I I get where you're coming up, uh, coming on Frisk, and don't. I I don't really like to raid discords. I don't think it's okay to ruin someone else's work. But um, I do have some couple of questions for you. Uh, basically in. In your case, with Chaos and Narrator, what they stated in their statement, do you think that they were mo emotionally abused by me? No. No, not really. No. Um, I think they were, you know, just being idiots. Honestly. Because if drama like this has been going on for years, and they don't they refuse to drop it then they're just morons honestly they're complete idiots mm -hmm. and the fact that they tried to raid the discord server but failed um is even more stupid because yeah we thought ahead how many times have they tried to how many times did they try to raid the discord server they they tried to raid it plenty of times but we have we, I uh, I made sure we have um, stuff that will prevent them mm -hmm. from actually getting into the server. So, um, and so, <clears throat> you know, it's not okay what they did. It's not okay what has happened so far. Do it's you the, uh, do you agree with their actions of what they did previously to me or? Like, do you agree with them doxing me and shit like that and saying, no. oh, you know, if they did do doxing? No. no, I really don't. Because, you know, the fact that they, the fact that um, they uh, decided to hack you is stupid. Very, very, very stupid. And mm -hmm. the fact that Captain tried to give his alt account administrator or uh, TFEA the fact that you know I was the one that caught it and you know 
the night that he had actually hacked your account, or the, at least when I was asleep, and then you had called me, Viper. I yeah. was fast asleep, and I had work in the morning. So that's twice now that they have done crap like this at very, very bad times, which I am mad at. And I, but, and I don't blame um, you for that either. I don't blame you. We all have a right to be annoyed at the factor. But, um, so Captain did release some information. Now, mind you, I'm just going to release it because I don't fucking give shit anymore. I'm not keeping his little dirty secret anymore. I'm done with this shit. He can get mad all he wants, but this is going to be released. And narrator can go screw himself. Chaos can go screw himself. Because honestly, I'm done with this. So, I have a picture from Captain. Mind you, I captured this when I blocked him. So, let's get this picture open. So, you remember the user Truth uh, 1227, right? It was one of the accounts. Yeah, um, did they did they send you any information about my personal information, like my address? Yeah, yeah. yeah. They, so they, they did. Um, so they tell me they they tell. So Captain told me this was Fedora. No, oh, I I don't really doubt it because um, you know Fedora was an even bigger idiot. Mm-hmm. So, in, in many cases, Fedora was the one who doxed me, and yet... Oh, so the thing is, with that, I had actually gone and looked at the website that they had, that I had found. I don't know who provided it to me, but, you know, they actually used very, very old information from you, or about you. So, it... Could have been Fedora. It could have been somebody else. I don't know. So well, I'm still, not gonna say much in that. In in still cases, it's still considered doxing because they used it to yeah. blackmail me and they used to threaten me. So in many cases, I don't condone these actions, and these people should be put into probably prison. To be fairly honest. If we're not saying the countless damages that they have done to this foundation, the harassment that they keep giving us, and the onslaught of attacks that we're just getting sick and tired of it. It's to the yeah. point where we feel the need to speak up against these people and actually deal with it. So in, in many cases, you have multiple TFEAs coming against you, like coming up and telling the truth of what they've done. Versus what we've done. And don't mind. Like mind you. Some of us do have mental disorders. Some of us have disabilities. That we cannot control. So. It's kind of. An issue where. We, we need to. Put up a stand. And basically say. Hey this foundation. These people are not good people. Do not risk it. And, you know, the fact that I have to talk about this while I'm on my break, yeah, make it three inconvenient times. Yeah. Because this is just, this is just stupid, in and, my opinion. And I don't, and I don't disagree, and I really didn't want to make this statement in the first place, but since Dave disobeyed my agreement, basically didn't even, <laughs> Chaos didn't even take down the document that he had with me. I've had about me because his document states that I'm mentally abused and I was corrupt and even more, even though many people have stated multiple times that I'm not corrupt and it's just, I need to make my statement publicly clear that yes, we run things differently here, but it's not corrupt. We actually choose our TFEAs from the O5 council. Yeah. If we see they're and, worthy and we put them through a trial of tests and errors, and if they make an error that's so small, it's we're we're gonna notice it, yes, but we're gonna 
put them on the right track and fix that error. If they don't want to fix it, then you're not worthy to be a TFEA. It's pretty simple. Yeah. That's why the TFEAs are handpicked from the O5 Council when we lose one. And we we do through a selection of votes. My meaning, yeah, and like it's a vote through the TFEA. It's not something that is uh, publicly knowledge, because I find it that everybody it's an thinks, internal matter. Everybody thinks that you know the TFEA is just free ranked. No, these are former O fives yeah. that have ran my foundation or run some capacity to my foundation. Of how I want it to be run. Yeah. But um, I thank you for your time Frisk. And I will let you continue. With your break dude. Thank you so much dude. Um, I really appreciate your time here. I'll be honest. I have like two minutes left. I can keep going if you want. I need to get, I need to get Mikey's statement now. You've answered all my questions. Hi Viper. Yeah. Hi Splat. Ah. Right. Well, um, after you like y'all don't, I'm just gonna mention something, so I'm just gonna wait. Hey, right. Mikey. Mikey, what? you ready? I want to be sure we rub it in his face. By the way. Oh my god. Oh yeah, it depends on if I. It depends on the situation, bro. Cool. Yeah, I know, but if it does happen, I will still want to rub it in his face. Agreed, agreed, homie. Agreed. <laughs> <laughs> Cosmic Sky, do not say anything. Send it to my DMs. Send it in my DMs. What exactly? Whatever you're going to send or delete, send it to my DMs because this is going to be on public information. Yeah, nice. So, send it to my DMs. I thought, I thought it was audio being recorded. <laughs> um, no, I'm recording everything, including my wow. wallpaper. But oh, I just. Okay. So, Mikey, you're next. Yeah. Um, okay. This is honestly your opinion about the cases and the situations of what happened. You can use either bad or good about our foundation. I don't care. Go as long as I'm questions. getting feedback from the Department of Founders of how we should proceed against the Captain. As much as I want to, I just don't think we would be really in a right mind of set to allow this to keep happening, so. I propose to ruin his right. life. Well, just that, ask your question, Somi. Alright, so... I told 832 to make a Trello system again, All and right. use the stuff that I sent him, so that'll okay. hopefully happen. Okay. Um, Mikey, so Yo. what has previously happened between you and Narrator, and Chaos and Captain? Like, all uh. three. Me and Chaos, we didn't get along unless there was other people. He had very different ideals from my own, which started to grow. He really didn't like me being in my O5 position at the time. Uh, I mean, even in the document that was told to be taken down, he still kept information about my reign, which mm -hmm. was a trial TFEAs. And, which made me a part of the TFEAs at the time to make a decision and bring voice my opinion to the public. However, be or however, chaos and like that and shit, um, shit like that. So that led me and him to not get along, I guess, unless there was a, unless it was with other people in VC. Uh, I mean, and with the other people, uh, narrator and narrator, and captain, and Fedora, Fedora, and me just got along pretty decently. I mean, I didn't. It was just more development stuff that I was look, watching him do, and narrator was just technically my overseer for ethics, so nothing bad there. I mean, uh, BE was always kind of just uh, hanging out in there for. He said he would be there for me and stuff, and we talked a lot in DMs about some random ass shit. Mm -hmm. So I mean, I guess there's that, and then Captain just uh, kind of told me to uh, just send him something in his DMs about. Uh, something that gamer guy Matt said on on his alt account. So, mm -hmm. so during the time when they were trying to overthrow me, do you think that what they did in those actions, what they did like doxing me and stuff like that, do you think I, those actions honest? were agreeable or disagreeable? 
I think it was shitty and disagreeable. I mean, fuck, it's a Lego game for Christ's sake. You get removed from one game, you go join another. It's that easy. Take the punishment and nothing more so happen. I mean, you get blacklisted from one community, then you just move on to another, honestly. It's easy. I mean, the fact that they wanted to overthrow you was bullshit because they knew it was going to fail because you have too many trusted people to back you. I mean, hell, I'm going to say this straight up. They got yelled at and cursed out in our own general chat because they wanted to take over. And because you, at that time, have left power, which meant everything that you did with the Discord was shut down and removed, which meant our uh, auto mod was removed because that was ran through that was ran through you. And um, at the time, people found out yeah, that you could end up saying the curse words and not. They just, the captain got cursed the hell out with the N-word and shit. I mean, I mean, if that doesn't prove that this foundation backs who they want to have lead them, then... I don't know what would, because mm -hmm. because if you're going to be overthrown, they need a lot more information than what they were trying to do. Uh, we, threatening to dox people? Go ahead, try to dox people that have not given you information. I want to see how well that works out. You'll threaten them with their face? What are you going to do then, huh? It's just a face, and if you're trying to find any old pictures, it's not going to work. I mean, people grow up, change. They look different when they're older than when they're younger. So just give up. It's a Lego game, in my opinion. And yeah. I'm going to say this up on both counts. Both fucking parties are fucking retarded at it, about it. Me included. If we just left it where it was in the beginning, after they broke the agreement and just banned them originally, and kept banning them from the ship without letting them explain, it would have just been better. In in my know. honest opinion, that's what we did. Yeah, that's originally what we did. It was just to the point where we physically, I mentally, physically, verbally, not mentally, verbally agreed to the terms that he would basically stop attacking us, and he and me and him physically got into a VC to stop attacking each other, even though we weren't attacking them in the first place. Man, they were attacking they were. us. Yeah, so it yeah. was to the I point mean, where we both, both sides came to an agreement to just stop and it's acting childish. My, but my in... biggest fucking complaint about this whole situation was the fact, their reasoning behind it. Mental abuse because of yelling? I'm sorry, ha but have people seen a COD lobby voice chat nowadays? You wanna be, you wanna call it mental abuse? Go get in a fucking COD game, a public one, without your fucking... Bitch boy pussy has friends backing you in a exactly. Xbox party or Discord call and sit there and listen to half the shit that gets said in an and COD lobby and then compare it to just you yelling? COD lobbies are ten times worse. What are you gonna and... do? Threaten Activision about that shit? <laughs> no. Activision ain't gonna do shit. It's how yeah. COD is. In, in my opinion, BE, Fedora, Captain, Narrator, Whoever the fuck they are, chaos. They're all little snowflake ass bitches, bro. If you can't take simple yelling at you, then get the fuck out. Yeah, they Leave. had to use alt bro. accounts to basically get into our foundation and basically do what they did. Exactly. I know it's retarded. They're so, absolutely dumb. It's and it's very funny opinion. that it's very funny that they did that in the first place, but. Mm -hmm. In your statement, do you agree with all their actions or disagree with all of their actions? I disagree, I disagree with everything they fucking did. They're fucking kids that are fucking think, stupid. Do you think the Department of Founders was in the right in this one by staying out of this drama and trying to just cause... Move, so move just on move with on, the foundation? Just move yeah, on with we, the foundation. we were in the right. right. Captain and them, they need to grow up. They need to stop being two-year-old fucking kids who think if they do this, then you get whatever the hell they want. No, grow up. This is the real world. You're not going to get whatever you want. You have to work for what you have. And that's just the way it is. If you're going to go out there attacking people, you're going to get ten times worse on you. And I mean, you don't want that? Then don't fucking do the stupid shit you do. It's simple. I mean, I'll stay, stick my line. And my line that I always, uh, that I've lived by in every shit when I go to do stupid shit. If you're willing to do stupid shit, then you aren't willing to grow up. If you mm -hmm. are willing to attack people, 
You are willing to just turn your backs on your friends whenever you need to. You are more than willing to to do anything just to get your wife. And that's why I look at it as, if you're going to attack people, you're just doing it because you want to get something out of it. You're just wanting it because you want it. Not because you have to. Not because there's a need to. Because you're, you're wanting to do it. I mean, I've seen that happen in our foundation. And don't, but I don't, it's not I don't, the severity of yeah. the, what fucking captain and them are doing. I and mean, then, we dealt with it in our foundation, fixed it, got to the bottom of why it was happening. Mm-hmm. But captain and them legit cannot let go of shit. They're, I would say, 18 year olds to like probably 15 year old kids who don't know what the fuck they're doing because they think being a, this Lego game actually means something. Like, it's, it's going to be on their fucking job application or some shit. It's not. Mm-hmm. So, for B to steal our ranks and our rank structure and shit like that, do you agree with him stealing something that made us unique and claiming that he made it? Do you agree with that? No, I don't. I mean, someone can look at the fucking history of this foundation, and they're going to see who actually owns the fucking ranking structure. Let people be retarded. They want to believe E, and they come to you talking about it, show them fucking evidence of how long we've been around with this ranking structure. They can't fight you. If you have physical evidence of it. Because they will be in the wrong. They'll side with you and go against the people. If you provide physical evidence of it, they have to side with the person with evidence. If they don't, well then, they're on the wrong side and they better choose wisely of what the fuck happens. Mm-hmm. Alright. Because our foundation is more than willing to fucking attack them. So, the next person that I'm going to be asking is Splat. And then the next person that I'm going to be going to is Cosmic Sky. Now, for the people that do not know who Cosmic Sky is, he is not a t- he is a TFE in trial period, but he's also an O5 for our DEA. Now, mind you, he was not here during this time of these events happening, so he will have an unbiased opinion and a neutral state a neutral opinion on both sides. So in this case, we're trying to, you know, just make sure both sides get their said and done. And then basically, Sky will speak about the, and will say if he agrees or disagrees about the uh, the events that happened. All right, Splat, you're next. What's up, Patches? I am just confused to what's going on. I just got out of school. That's, right. uh, it's about the Captain, Chaos, B.E., and, uh... Fedora. What about them now? So, Public opinion, so you want to state about them? Mm-hmm. To be honest, I don't have that much to say about them. All I just have to say is I particularly hate them. So, do you do you agree with their actions or disagree with their with what they did, basically? I don't agree with what they did at all. Do you think that uh, an administrator, as the owner, for example, B, which he's trying to start up his own SCPF, do you agree with their their actions as an administrator during, well, before that time that they started? Do you agree with their actions right now when they are no. starting up their foundation? Do you no. think they should run a foundation if they think... No. I don't think so. I think that foundation is going to crumble any uh, any second they start it up. Do you think that they were mentally abused in any way, such, or form? No. I've been mentally abused way worse, sir. Simp, a.k.a. Call of Duty lobbies. Mm-hmm. I can imagine. I've played Call of Duty. <laughs> that is mental abuse. Getting yelled at by you, that's just, reg- that's just a grown adult yelling at people. That's not mental abuse. Yeah, and which I do it sometimes to get a straight point because I can't hear myself think when all of y'all are yelling at a fucking chat. I get yelled at constantly by my parents, and that's not mental abuse. They're trying yeah. to get something through my brain since I'm not listening. Yeah. Okay. Do you do you agree with what they did to me? Do you disagree? Do you agree or disagree with what they did to me? And what do you think should change? From their act, from our actions towards them. Hmm. To be honest, be more defensive against them to like to the next time so nothing else could happen that's related towards them. Also, I don't agree with them doxing you. 
So, yeah. Do you agree with them trying to hack into my Discord account and basically getting inside and getting access to They tried to do that? Yes, they did. Oh, no, definitely not. Do you think B should be an administrator of an SCPF? No, he should be a test subject. Thank you, Splat. That's all the questions. Now I'm gonna put it over Damn. to Sky. In many, in many cases of what you've heard today, Sky, do you disagree or agree with everything that Captain BBH, Narrator, and Chaos did to this foundation? Oh, first of all, can someone explain what happened? Because I have no clue. Okay, so I'll explain. I can explain, Viper. That's okay. Basically, those three, the um, B, Fedora, and Captain BBH. Fedora used to be a, found, a developer for this foundation. B and, but Fedora went rogue, but he also joined another SCPF I was in and banned me because the TA accidentally gave him administrative perms. But that's okay. off track anyways. Anyways, he, Fedora went rogue and literally, and he, he w worked with B and tried to dox Germ, which they did. And then they try to hack into his multiple, multiple times into his accounts, to them failing and him getting his accounts back. Not to mention so they, they also uh, tried to. I don't know how much truth is this, but they did dox another member of this foundation. Yeah, mm -hmm, they did. So. But so basically, those three are basically just doxers and B and B trying to start up with SCPF. What do you think about that? So basically, what I'm hearing is that two children are doxing others due to a Lego game. Well, three of them. Three, they're, all three of them are children. Three Technically, children. B isn't a grown ass adult. Well, true. Oh, he's a grown out. Yes. He's a grown adult. The other two are teenagers. Wow. What country are they from, by chance? They like. They're like in the UK, if I remember correctly. Uh, no. B is in the UK. Fedora is in the Norwegian area. And Chaos, I believe he's in the United States. Mm -hmm. I cannot give too much information about their actual areas because this would be going up on YouTube and I don't really need a mm -hmm. need cool. any trouble with that. Well Captain I don't know of, so I can't really say anything. I think he's in the US. I get mixed answers from Captain, so at my guess, yes, he would be in the U.S., but I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so question, did he actually dox you or not? He did. Cool. Then Fedora doxed me. And and be done with it. Yeah, Fedora doxed Viper, Viper, and Fedora went rogue. B was aware of the doxing incident and basically allowed it to happen, because in that statement, they even stated they literally allowed B... To be the head of the operation, the spearhead of my oper of that operation to get me out of power. Okay, look, the only thing I'm going to tell you, right, as the person here who studies to be a lawyer, I'll just tell you one thing, just go to the cops, report it, and be done with it. Like, it's not going to be our problem anymore, you're going to ruin his life, and boom. Viper is already kind of part of the um, law enforcement division, that's cybersecurity. Perfect, and just do it and be done oh, with it. Oh, I've already reported him to the FBI. So cool. Then yeah, be down with it. Yeah. That's all none of your problems. Sadly anymore. they couldn't do anything because there was not very much information left. Oh. Yeah. Okay, that's sad. I only had a the only thing I had was his phone number to be physically contact for um, me. Yeah. So that's the only information that I had. That sucks. Yeah. So I didn't I couldn't provide very much too much, but besides the point, this is just a public statement. Do you agree with their actions? Do you disagree with their actions that happened these past events? Well, from the info that I heard, obviously I do not agree with them. Like who would? I don't I don't disagree with you with that one. Do you think the 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 spearhead of the operation B should be running as a foundation? In the community, do you think he should be doing this? Well, I mean, if he's associated with doxers, in my honest opinion, I don't even—I would not want to be joining him. 
to be fair, or, to be fair, Neither would I. Because that's my information at risk. Mm. While I'm doing the community meeting with my CPF, so I'll be typing. All right, Mikey, do you do you do you think you want your information stolen by someone that runs another SCPF that doxes people? Mm, no, but no. luckily enough, I'm not sharing too much information about myself other than my depression in my face. So, good luck. <laughs> Also, uh, another I, thing I, to I, bring up, they did talk I, about your depression, about you, Mikey. Yeah. They did talk a I, lot yeah, about you saying that you fake depression and shit. Mind you, I've actually witnessed Mikey be depressed and be scared and be everything during mm -hmm. that time. And I don't, Mikey, I don't like scare tactics. I don't Mikey, like scare tactics. You need to talk to me. Oh, oh yeah, I know. I everything's fine now. I. Uh... I have a group of people that uh, have definitely brought out my spirits, so I don't need to worry about it. Yeah, we're also here if you need it, Mikey. Yeah, I know, homies. I don't like how they did that, and in many cases, that was also an additional thing that I needed to bring up. But at this time, I think this is all I needed to make a public statement. Um, thank you guys for all of you to be here currently at this time that even including Sky. I really appreciate all of you for your opinions and your feedback and also your statements. Let's hope that this video actually gets B to realize what he did and what we know. He's screwed. Let's just hope that he's screwed in the end. Mm. Because I do not want any more people to be at risk. I do not need another swift unknown group. To be fairly yeah. honest, we don't need another Swift Unknown group in the genre. We literally, we do not. We just, oh god, it was horrible. Oh I remember god. Swift Unknown. I don't even want to talk about it. This is nice the. No, I don't. This I is don't the. Want to talk uh, this is the end of the SCPF public statement of the Department of Founders. Enjoy.